Hello everyone and welcome to the 4th or 5th, I don't know how many I am in, so welcome to this tutorial on Mod Loader. Today I have a cool tutorial that will allow you to use your keyboard to open the GUI we just created. So, let's say you wanted the key M to open the, something like a GUI or something. I will teach you that and let's start by creating a new variable so public and now key binding and now the name of the variable which I will call key, key. and this is going to be equals to a new key binding and the variables are open GUI this is a string and the key you want so keyboard dot and let's choose a key I will say key M you can choose whatever key you want now that we have this variable with the name GUI key let's make it that it, you can be you can change it in your options menu in your Minecraft so model there already has a method that do that does that so all you need to write is mod loader dot register key register key and the variables that we need to pass are this the second one it is this dot and the name of your variable in my case GYQ and the flag is false and the next thing we need to add a location so mod loader dot add locate local localization I'm sorry Look. and I will here we just have to input two strings in my case I will put open GUI and again open GUI well now that we have this if we run it you can go I will show you if we run it we can go to the options and we can change our open GUI key so now in order for you to use this let's just erase all this in tick so you can see what I mean that this isn't ticking anymore well it is but you are not seeing it let's go to to our base mod and if you see you have a method here called keyboard event copy that and paste it on your on your mod well inside all you need to do is check if our key was pressed and to do that it's very easy just write if the key binding binding it's equals to this dot and the name of your variable in my case GYQ key I'm sorry and if this is correct all you need to do is MC which is this variable which has the Minecraft insta instance dot display GUI screen and it's like the other one new GUI start and the variables is this no I'm sorry world um, world this MC if I'm not mistaken let me just world this MC oh yeah correctly so let's just run this and let's just go to a regular world I that I have already done while I was testing this and right now I'm I will press the M in my keyboard and our GUI appears with this if I 
click escape I will close it and open escape to close and if you go to your options controls I can change it let's change it to O and if I press O it opens if I press M it doesn't so I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial it is a very quick tutorial and can help you with a lot of things I find it useful I found that this is useful so if you guys enjoyed this tutorial leave me a like if you guys want to see more tutorials like this please subscribe to the channel because when I reach 50 subscribers I will start Java tutorials like Java is a very cool language because you can make such great games in it and it's very very easy it's like writing in English basically so if you if you guys want subscribe of course I will not you it's free so it is a bonus anyway if you want me to do some kind of tutorials go to the forum my forum topic and leave me what you think I should do or just in the comments of this video and until the next episode guys have a nice day